much for being here with us tonight. We have a great show for you tomorrow, To Wait until you hear what's happening at Marinelli Field. You do not want to miss this. One more thing before we go tonight. May is Asian American and Pacific Islander Heritage Month. We're celebrating tonight with Joy Sauce late night host, Jonathan Spotsado. How are you? I'm really great. Thank you so much for having me. Really appreciate it. Yeah, the Joy Sauce Network is really amazing. How long did it take for you to turn this idea into a reality? Well, it actually took a while. You know, I'm kind of a startup entrepreneur, and so this is no different. Um, I would say that we were planning it for a good year and a half, mm -hmm. and then it was a matter of just sort of getting the network to rally and support and partner with the right people. And so we're just delighted to present uh, the very first sort of all Asian American media platform with shows, you know, scripted narratives and reality TV shows and podcasts and, and written incisive uh, editorials. So we've got it all here. Yeah, your show is Joy Sauce Late Night is very fun. I love the set, the graphics, how they're like interjected into the show. What do you love most about doing that? You know, I, I love that what we did was we took the most canonically uh, sort of American uh, format, mm -hmm. which is the late night talk show. And, and I think that that's really one of the last spaces that you see uh, Asian Americans be sort of uh, have access to. And so I love that we sort of created the very first all Asian American late night talk show. The hosts, all of the guests, you know, all of the writers, uh, and even the camera people and and the comedy sketch writers. I mean, it's all you know the musical guests. Um, so so I love that it's a first. It's really and it's really fun. It's very funny. I watched the episode yesterday um, with Kimmy was co-hosting with you. She did a great oh. job, and I just <laughs> think it's such a great platform for people to talk about um, what it's like too. She was kind of explaining how how she was so impressed with what you did, and then the fact that she gets to work there is a dream. <laughs> just very yeah, awesome. Well, that means a lot coming from you, and that's exactly the point: is that you don't have to be Asian American to enjoy it. I mean, I want people to watch it, and maybe halfway through or at the end realize. Oh my gosh, everyone on a show was Asian American. How cool was that? Uh, but you don't have to be Asian to 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 enjoy it. It's really for everyone. Absolutely. Yeah. What do you hope Joy Sauce does for the entertainment industry? Well, I hope that it opens some eyes that that you don't at the on one hand, uh, one does not have to be extraordinary or exceptional. Like you have to be a kung fu master or you have to be uh, uh, incredibly exotic uh, to 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 in order to uh, 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 participate. Sure. That Asian Americans are just like everyone else. I would love for there to be an Asian American Tom Hanks. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like just, just we're like everybody else and I want people to see that we can do all of these same things. Well, it's very cool that you brought uh, Joy Sauce Network to us. We can find it online and I'm sure everyone will check it out. Thank you so much for your time tonight, Jonathan. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Absolutely. Cheers. Talking with you. And thank you for watching too. We'll see you tomorrow night. Bye-bye.